Ever wonder how carpal tunnel release surgery is actually done? Let's break it down in a simple way. The procedure usually starts with numbing the hand and wrist using local anesthesia, so the patient stays awake but feels no pain. Once the area is prepped, the surgeon makes a small incision in the palm or uses a tiny camera with an endoscopic technique. The main goal is to locate a tight band of tissue called the transverse carpal ligament, which is squeezing the median nerve and causing symptoms like tingling, numbness, and weakness. The surgeon carefully cuts this ligament to release the pressure on the nerve without touching the nerve itself or removing any bone. After the pressure is relieved, the incision is closed with stitches or adhesive strips. The entire surgery usually takes less than 30 minutes, and patients often go home the same day. Over time, the ligament heals in a more open position, giving the nerve extra space and allowing symptoms to improve.